overall points scored. Now let's get to the bottom of the wildcard weekend perfect lineup. The game didn't end the way Washington fans had hoped, but you liked that Kirk Cousins scored you 21.36 FanDuel points. In fact, you loved that. 26.12% of you played him at $8,000. Washington wasn't exactly known for the run game going into the weekend, but Chris Thompson was able to squeak out a fine performance. He scored 15.4 points in 0.45% of lineups while only costing $4,800. It seems that the Steelers will lean on any running back that is in the game. Recently obscure Fitzgerald Toussaint was in 18.1% of entries while costing $5,700 and scoring 13.8 FanDuel points. Martavis Bryant led the way with 15.8 points in 12.1% of lineups. He cost you $6,900 in his matchup against Cincinnati. And on the other side of that matchup, AJ Green mustered up 15.6 FanDuel points. He cost $8,300 and 36.2% of you rostered him. Rounding out the lot, Randall Cobb put up his first double-digit FanDuel performance since week 14. Cobb helped propel the Packers to victory by scoring 13.7 points in 14.4% of rosters while costing $6,500. Jordan Reed did it again. This phenom scored 22.5 points in a whopping 48.04% of lineups while being the most expensive tight end on the board at $7,400. Cairo Santos kicked his way to 14 FanDuel points while costing 17.6% of you $4,800. And the Kansas City Chiefs went crazy last weekend. They put up 29 points in 23.57% of lineups with a $5,100 price tag.